In this brief video, we're going to share with you the five different resorts at the Ibero Star Bavaro complex in Punta Cana, Dominican Republic. This is a map of the resorts showing the five different resorts. And from left to right, we're going to start with the Punta Cana, the Dominicana, the Coral Level Suites, the Bavaro Suite Selection, and the Grand Bavaro. This is the one we stayed at. And I'm going to put a link above so you can check out that complete, honest review video that I made of that particular resort. As we enter the lobby of the Dominicana, over to the right is the casino, which I didn't show you, but here's the front desk on the left. And just past the front desk, on the left, you see the buffet. And over on the right, there is a little market. Here's the buffet. You can serve your own drinks, your own coffee. It's very laid back. Don't forget, this is adults and children as well. Very massive, this buffet. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, there is a casino. And they open from 2 p.m. to 3 a.m. every day. There is a section for the theater. So this is where they have nightly shows. Over to the right-hand side. And on the left-hand side, you have the buffet right over there. Behind the buffet from the Dominicana, this is where you will see both properties unite and they share one garden area. Over on the left was the Punta Cana, over on the right was Dominicana. And this is the pool area. Again, children are allowed as well. It's adults and children, so families are allowed in these properties. Here is um, the atrium of the Dominicana. And by the way, the Punta Cana is almost exactly alike. You're gonna see that in a moment. And we'll look at a room at the Dominicana as well as the Punta Cana. Iberostar Star was uh, gracious enough to show us a couple of the rooms. Also, throughout the property, they do have water and ice dispensers. So if you have your own cups or tumblers, you can use them there. So this is a standard room at the Dominicana. You have your standard bathroom. It does have a safe and a refrigerator. Of course, ironing board and iron. And the refrigerator does have some drinks. And those are the water uh, tumblers that you can fill up yourself if you'd like. They'll fill up for you. And your drinks in your fridge. One thing that I liked about this is that it does have a standard coffee maker. So if you like to bring your own coffee and your own filters, you can do that as well. This is a garden view, again, at the Dominicana. Next, this is a Punta Cana standard room. Very similar. The shower is a little bit different. Maybe a little bit nicer, if you will. And the rooms are pretty much uh, standard, the same as the Dominicana. This one happens to be a pool view room. By the way, these properties do offer Star Camp. Star Camp is a program for children, and you can find out more at the Iberia Star website. And here's some information if you want to freeze frame this and check it out. They also have for teenagers. Eagle is the program for teenagers from 13 to 17. They do have a disco as well. Now from the Punta Cana Dominicana, we're walking over to the coral level. Once you go towards the coral level, there are some stores. So if you see something that says at the shopping center, that's where you'll find it. For example, the disco, uh, you'll find it in this area as well. So coral level, exclusive area. That's the third property on the map that I showed you earlier. Here are the coral level um, villas, if you will. Here's the coral level lobby, a lot smaller than the other lobbies because uh, it's more quaint, uh, quieter. We were not able to view a room at the coral level because it was sold out, but this uh, shot was provided to us from Iberostar themselves. Here's the coral level pool, exclusive only to coral level guests.
right off of the coral level pool is El Faro, which is the coral level restaurant right there next to the pool facing the Caribbean Sea. Now, Iberostar Star has a unique feature known as the Coral Lab, and this is where it's a research facility that studies the impact of coral bleaching in the surrounding oceans. So feel free to pause some of the parts of this video to read what's on there. Uh, there they're growing uh, corals, and it's really something incredible. They not only do it here, but I believe they do it also at other Ibero Star uh, resorts. So it's something great for the kids as well. And they do allow people to come in and check it out and ask questions. They have people there all the time uh, to answer any questions. Now here we are at the Barrao Suites selection. This is, uh, so we saw the Punta Cana, we saw the Dominicana, the Coral Level, and this is the Barrao Suites selection. Uh, again, this, this has a water park, which is really cool. And um, unfortunately, we were not able to see a room because they were sold out as well, but this shot was provided to us from Ibero Star themselves. Ah, uh, the Ibero Star Grand Bavaro, the Piste de Resistance. This is the hotel we stayed at. This is the only resort on the complex or in the complex that is adults only. This is the one on the map is all the way to the right. It's adults only. This is the one we stayed at. And I'm going to be putting a link above uh, this video so you can check out the entire review that I made on this hotel. Here's a few pictures of the hallways. And um, let's check out the room. Now, uh, one thing that's interesting about these rooms is that every single room is exactly the same. Same setup. Um, so, again, all the rooms are exactly the same. They're beautiful, they're pristine, and very elegant as well. Uh, you're going to see something really cool in the bathroom. By the way, that little bag on that chaise lounge, that bag has a couple of towels. That way, when you go to the pool, you don't have to stop at the, at the towel area. So, there's a rain shower, um, and of course, you have a separate um, section for the commode. Now, one thing that's really cool is the jacuzzi tub. Also, check out a video I made about uh, if you don't have bubble bath, you can create it with shower gel. And these curtains come down. And yes, it does face the, uh, the balcony. This particular room is a lagoon view room. Uh, they have different uh, uh, levels, if you will. And again, regardless of what level you're at, the room setup is exactly the same.